Hello friends, as it is true with all the diseases, we should never jump into diagnosis and treatment. Same is true when we get a patient of cleft foot in an OP. So we should have a thorough screening examination to rule out other congenital anomalies apart from cleft foot. In this examination video, I will be demonstrating quick screening examination of a child presenting with cleft foot in a busy OP. Thank you. So this is right side cleft foot and this is normal foot. There is equinus, there is cavus and heel virus which is visible in prone position or from behind. So if we look at the quick Pirani uh, scoring, it is almost 6 by 6. There is equinus, there is posterior crease, there is empty heel and in the midfoot the teller head is not reducible, the curved lateral border is almost one and there is deep medial crease. And always stroke the sole of the feet to look at the movement of toes to rule out the neurogenic cleft foot or peroneal dysfunction and this is the normal foot. Now we go for hip examination to rule out any hip dysplasia or hip dislocation. This is part of screening of hip in every newborn child and this is more important in case of presence of cleft foot. Now we move on to inspection of spine. It should be done with full exposure of spine. Look for any pimple, sinus or any tuft of hair especially in the lumbosacral area. Now we move on to examination of upper limb to look for any associated congenital anomalies and we can examine the neck also for torticollis. Thank you.